teaching here. Make sure you type your name into the chat. Okay, what superhero would you be? Make sure you have your math binders too. You're gonna need your math binders and your journal that you've been taking notes in. And a heads up, just in case Somehow I was able to log into Zoom this morning because it wasn't working like if I go through like Google, but I have it downloaded to my computer. And there's a lot of schools that are having issues with it right now. So just in case it kicks us out or it ends abruptly, don't panic. I'll send y'all a message through Canvas just letting you know I'll get back on whenever it gets fixed. So if you have siblings that are trying to Zoom right now, make sure, and they're they're not able to, it's probably because it's it's like a problem district-wide. So hopefully it doesn't kick us out or anything like that crazy going on. But I almost thought we weren't gonna have a Zoom meeting this morning, but just in case something happens, don't panic. I'll send you a message through Canvas and we'll figure it out on the go. Anybody do anything fun this weekend? Zildjian, how'd you get the donut on your name? <laughs> Y'all see his name is a donut. And then an emoji? Oh, that's weird. I wonder if I could put one. I went to the name and I just renamed myself and put an emoji. Cool. <sighs> Remember, make sure you put your name in the chat. There's only 11 of y'all. There should be like three more of y'all. B, no, Bila put hers in there. Siljan put his in there. Jacob was the first one. Oh, I guess that is every or Michael. We're missing Michael. AJ, you missed our show and tell on Friday. Sorry. And this one we're gonna fix. Did I miss it too? And that way you have uh, your yes, because you left it right. You left a little bit early, didn't you? Okay. Yeah, for a doctor's yeah. appointment. We had it like right after you yep. left. I think it was around two, two, two thirty. Yeah. 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 So just in case, yeah. Wait a few more minutes. Make sure you have your math. We get to start 
we really have a lot of work this week. And just an FYI, I don't know, now that we're really getting into reading, if that break we have in the morning is going to be 30 minutes every day and we're in math, like really starting math now. So don't get upset if our break's only 15 or 20 minutes in the morning. And if we're working probably until 3 o'clock almost every day now just because of our work, we have a lot of work now. So... And there's a lot. I don't know how many of y'all have gotten on Canvas. Your child. Um, oh, my child. A lot of work, but I'm going to walk y'all through it here in a little bit just to show y'all because it's just, it goes day by day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, but there's a lot in there. Don't get overwhelmed if you go in there and see all of the assignments or all this work you have to do. It's okay. Why did you do that? As much as we can, we'll get it done. No, to work on it. You have to. Don't put your first and last name in there. Okay? Let's type in your first name. Okay, start right here. Yeah, turn it on, turn it on. Mom. Oh, I forgot my attendance paper I have. I had at home. Okay. I'm missing. Who's missing? Who's not? Oh, coming. There's Andre. Only the first one. Um, who else is missing? Almost everybody here. Oh, oh Adrian. Adrian's not in here, is he? Yeah. Interesting. Make sure you have your math. Oh, we're missing Chloe with a C. Yes. Adrian said to come in here in a few minutes. Say, did I miss anything? Hello, can you hear me? Watch. Wants to bet. Bet a candy when you get back to school. That's what he's going to say. Why don't you do that? And say, are we missing? Well, some of them have their videos stopped. I know. Remember, turn your videos on so I know if you're paying attention and you're doing the assignments. I don't want to spend all Friday More have their videos talking stop. everybody up. Uh, what's it and oh. another one has their videos stopped. So, they, so you think you're they're not here. Is right there. Is it? Oh, Chloe with the K, Natalie, and Sierra, right? 
RJ looks very comfortable in his sweater yeah. right there. Right? Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Breathing in, RJ. He's got his little sweater on. I don't know where he's at. He came off the video. You mean Randy has a sweater on? Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, this is Azu. Azu? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we have Azu here. He's been in our class for a little while, guys, but he hasn't he's had some technical difficulties with his computer. So if y'all want to say hi to him, y'all can. Hi. 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 <laughs> He's, he's okay. been in our class since last week, but he's had some computer problems. He's wondering what to do right now. What should he get? Uh, we're, um, he needs his math binder to start with. So if he okay, has he has it right there. All right, thank you. Uh -huh. okay, so, Azu, we kind of wait in the morning for about 10 minutes just to make sure everybody gets here, and then we go over the pledge, and then we'll start from there, just so we don't start too early in the morning and people come in asking questions, okay? You got any questions, you can type them into the chat or you can raise your hand or anything like that. And like I tell the class, I can't um, figure out why YouTube won't work on my computer, but I have the smart board, so we'll play the pledges on here. Good morning, friends. We're going to begin the day by saying the Pledge of Allegiance. Okay, so I want everyone to quietly stand up. You don't have to talk. Quietly stand up. And then I want you to put your right hand over your heart. And now we are going to look at the flag and we will say the words together. Okay, here we go. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good job. You did it. Okay, everyone, quietly sit back down, and I want you to have a wonderful day at school. I'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye. That wasn't the craziest guy, was it? It was cute. Was it the crazier guy? That wasn't the crazier guy, was it? Hello? What did I tell you? Say hello. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't hit that on me. What are you doing? The Texas part. Adrian, did you um get your books? Yes. Sweet Larry James, that's awesome. Good, because we're using him. Turn to face the front. Place your right hand over your head. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to you. Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please wait for a moment of silence. Let's go over some. What's happening to your eye, Jacob? Let's go over some stuff. Like I was telling y'all, that came in later, just in case for some reason something happens with Zoom because there's been di a district wide problem. I'm assuming people people are logging in. Like I couldn't log in the normal way I logged in. I had to log in a different way. So if it kicks us out or kicks me out, I'm gonna send you a message or something. Um, through Canvas letting you know our situation, but hopefully it does not kick us out or anything like that. Hopefully we don't have any problems, but if it does, I'll let you know. We'll try to try it again a few minutes later if something happens. Got it? Yeah, because some people have a lot of, like, has a lot of bad Wi-Fi. Well, no, it's like a district-wide problem. It's like, I was talking with the other teachers, and then they couldn't log in either. It's like a a big problem district wide but if something happens don't panic i'll message y'all through canvas letting y'all know what we're gonna what we're gonna do and how we're gonna finish 
are going to get it working again if it works. But back to what we're doing. Make sure you have your math binder. But before we go, I want to share my screen before we start with math and kind of show y'all. Kind of show Okay, sorry, I muted. I muted you, Sierra, because it was like, I don't know what was going on. So, on Canvas, I think I'm going to unpublish some of this stuff because. On Canvas, you have your whole week for math. There's a lot on there now that we're really moving on into learning new stuff. This is all for the whole week of math. I think I'm gonna unpublish some stuff because there's a lot of stuff on here. Just because some of you are gonna get overwhelmed if I Some of y'all, I think, have already looked at it. Anyways, but everybody, oh, yeah. math binder. We get out of there. Okay. Yes, everybody has a math binder. Thumbs up so we can start. So we're going over. If you need to speak, remember you're on mute. Um, we're gonna go over place value again. Last week we started it, but if we would have kept going, we would have been ahead. So. We stopped place value. We're going to go back into place value. There's a lot in over place value. A lot of work over place value this week. It's huge. It's huge this week. It's huge. And it's huge in fourth grade. It's a big, it's a big, um, I guess like teaks or something, I guess as you would say on star. It's really tested a lot on star. So it's really important that you pay attention and you follow along and you do your best because it's a big part of fourth grade. So let's see. I don't know that we really need to be on Canvas right now, but hmm. I'm trying to think if I want to start with the video first, maybe. Hmm. I think I'm going to start with the video first because why not a video of place value? Song. We'll listen to a song first. Oh, no, no, no. I'm your mama, champion of school. I keep you busy, baby. Today we will learn. I sit confused, wondering how. The water's worth more than two. Teacher said, don't worry, it's easy. So not only in fourth grade do we learn to the millions, we'll eventually learn to the billions on Wednesday, I think it's when we go over place value to the billions. We have 10 places. In two, two days, we, in two days, we'll learn um, the billions.
each place to the right is ten times more or ten times less than the previous. So <clears throat> that's what it's telling us. Each place that way is one tenth. So if I ask you, um, how much less is this eight compared to that? This eight is one tenth of that eight. So it would take ten of those one ones place eights to make that ten. That eight. Sorry, it's just confusing. And then each place to the left is 10 times greater. So this number right here is 10 times greater than that number. So that's what it's telling you right there. Go over there to give me that. Come on. Anyways, we're done with that video. We're done. But I might leave that up here. No, I want to play. Okay. In your math binder. I'll take it easy on y'all. Let's start with skills. We need to finish our skills. Let me share my screen so I can show y'all what we're talking about. Skills, the green part of your binder. I think we're on skills three. Skills, under skills, the green. Math binder. Math binder, yes. Adrian has a fresh math binder, so he has no work in it. We're going to finish the skills we started last week, and we are going to be working on fractions again, because fractions are big, too, in fourth grade. So skills, I think we're on three, right? It should look awfully familiar, because we did a lot of these skills during um, our Nearpods, if y'all remember. Y'all remember those Nearpods we had trouble with last week? Oh, sweet Larry James. Hopefully, we don't have that much trouble with this, them this week. I think it's, it's going to say skills page three up top. Make sure it says skills page three up top. I got it. Perfect. Skills. Energy, right? Hey, remember, turn on y'all's videos. <laughs> I can see your shining faces early in the morning. Like I said, if you want to point it up, you can point it up. But skills on page what? It doesn't. It just says skills um, three, page one. Thumbs up when you're on this page, so we can start. Good. 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 Okay, my skills. I think I'm probably already starting on it. Okay. AJ showing me that he's on that one. Perfect, AJ. See, Natalie looks like she's working. Mariah, you have it. Yeah, I'm here. Okay, let's go. Let's get started. So, right, oh, this is so small. I wish I had my, I'm going to try to make it as big as I can for y'all. It's better. Okay, so write a fraction that represents the shaded area of each model for one through five. So how many equal parts do we have here? Eight. 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 And that's going to be our denominator or our numerator? Denominator. Denominator. Good job. So we have eight. And who can tell me how many shaded we have? Five. Five. Good job. Um, that's Chloe with a K. I'm going to write this down on here. Number of shaded parts. This thing's moving. Um, number of equal parts. Yeah, I don't have to write this down. This is just... Five. Oh, I can't even see it. Oh, okay. Besides Chloe with the K, how many equal parts do I have here? Five. Five. Chloe with the K. Besides Chloe with the K, somebody else tell me how many are shaded. I think you are working. Three. Good job, Natalie. Besides Natalie and Chloe, I want to hear somebody else. I'll let y'all work on two, three, and or three, four, and five, and then we'll come back together in a couple of minutes and 
answer them together. Let me put a timer on. If you need help, let me know. Give you two minutes should be good. If you need help for some reason, let me know now. It's okay to need help. Wait, we can do six two. Um, I guess you can start on it. Yeah, sure. Yeah, if you want to look at six, if you finish, if you run, re get done with these really fast, you can go ahead and look at six. Like I said, these were all on our Nearpod last week, so they might look pretty familiar. Let's see how long we have. 46 seconds. I think Azu, I think you might have already finished this, right? I think I told your mom last week, maybe. You might have. Should have eaten more breakfast because I'm hungry. Uh, all right, who can tell me what they got for number three? Me. Go ahead. Um, one half. One half. Besides Natalie, who can tell me what they got for number four? Me. Go ahead. Two. Two shaded and three equal. Yes, whoever that was. Is that Ray Ray? That was a new one. Adrian. It was me, Adrian. Uh, who, what did y'all get for number five? Seven, twelve. Twelve out of seven. Uh uh, twelve goes on the bottom. Seven twelfths, Chloe. Seven twelfths. Seven twelfths, not twelve out of seven, okay? Because that would be an improper fraction. You say twelve out of seven. So flip your numbers, okay? Number six. Ooh, this one was a trickier one. Let me zoom out so you can see the whole problem. I remember it. Yeah, these are all on your Nearpods. So a fourth grade teacher um, made a banner that was divided into eight equal parts. Three of the parts were hearts, two of the parts were stars, the rest of the parts were dots. What fraction of the banner had dots? So that's when we went in and we drew hearts, I think, right? Yeah. Yes. Hearts on three to show, right? And then we had stars on two parts. So then it said, how many had dots? Three eighths. Three eighths. Good job, because only, they should have gotten there, because only three of them had dots. That's why I drew that was I actually drew hearts and dots in there so that I could see what I was how many actually had dots. That's what I, I got. Put numbers spot two. Six, I mean. You put numbers? What do you mean you put numbers? Yeah, so um on the hearts there I drew I sketched everything out and then I put one, two, oh, okay. three, four, five, six, seven in the corners. Oh, okay. So I just kind of looked. Uh -huh. And it made it easier, I guess, because if you knew you had yeah. eight, you just went down in one, two, three. Yeah, that makes sense. Good job. What's the backside look like? I'm going to take it out of here. Ooh, this is the one with the rectangle, wasn't it? Right? Yep. 
and draw a rectangle. Okay. So Nick drew a rectangle and divided it into six equal parts. He colored two parts of the rectangle blue, one part yellow, and the rest <coughs> were colored red. Draw a rectangle and label it accordingly. So. <laughs> draw my rectangle. We're going to use the same rectangle for seven, eight, and nine. Can you go back to number six? So y'all that are done already with number six, y'all can go ahead and look at, draw your rectangle for number seven, eight, and nine. I was gonna get the near pass. There. Got it, RJ? Yes. Okay. On my rectangle, we need six equal parts. My rectangle does not look equal, but it's got six parts. <coughs> Two parts were shaded in blue. So I'm going to shade them in blue. I don't have to do it in blue. But let's see. One part was yellow. And the rest were red. Do you have handy dandy highlighters? I can use them. So what fraction of the rectangle is red? Three. Three. Out of what? Six. Six. Good job. <coughs> Why do I have a scratch in my throat? What is the next I'm going to go get me some water because I finished. What does the next one say? What? Mm. What fraction of the rectangle is blue? So what fraction of the rectangle is blue? The top. Oh, two. Two out of what, RJ? Good job. How many equal parts do you have here? Two out of six. Good job. And then it says, what fraction of the rectangle is yellow? One. One out of six. Good job. Good job. It's so crazy though how if I show you it says district or Zoom's not working district try, but I don't know how I got it to work. Y'all are lucky we got it to work. We're fortunate. When you get on your phone, you can just get on the internet. Okay. I'm gonna go to Okay. Um number ten. It says in the space below, draw a rectangle that represents eight equal parts. Say five out of eight, five eighths of the rectangle. So, um. You shade in five eighths. I think that's all you had to do with that one. I'm gonna shade them in with my paper towel here. Now remember.
remember this from last week? Okay. Writing the near pod codes down. So we're done with that for the day. <sighs> Are you ready for place value? Yeah. Yeah, you think so? Mm -hmm. Oh wait, before we go, I wanted to do this. We forgot to do it last week. It's un it's behind your concept. So go to your concept. In your math binder, and then it has gridables where you have to fill in each one of these. I wanted to go over this with y'all because I didn't get to do it last week. Okay, I'm here. Should look like this. There's gridables. I've done these before in third grade. Yes. Some of y'all have done these before. But when you're putting these in, you don't start over here. You start all the way over here, like when you're subtracting. So you would put a five here, a two, a five, a six. Antonio, we're working out of our math binder, and we're on the steps, and then it has right behind it, or should be in a page or two of that, the gridables. I'm going to go use the restroom. Okay. okay. I finished it. Okay. Let's do B. So B has oh, the right amount to fill in there. So you need to start three, nine, four, two, one. Oh man. Some of these teachers are having so much, so many problems right now with Zoom and everything. It's funny. Okay, I finished that one too. Not a six, sorry. It's supposed to be a nine. Which one are you on? Because I can't find it. I can't hear if somebody's asking. We're on con concepts, the yellow page. Concepts, and then we're on gridable. Come on, y'all speed it up. I was going to tell you up here, you can put a zero if you want to there. It doesn't matter, or you don't have to put a zero there. So, just as a, like a, a placer, I guess. You don't have to put a zero, but you can. It doesn't matter. It won't change. It won't make it wrong or right if you don't put the zero or if you do put the zero. It's okay. Either way. Can we do the rest on our own? Uh, let me try C, and then I watch, and then I'll let y'all try the rest on your own. So you have 61.72. And I wanted to show y'all this. So. If you put your 61 over here, 
you, I'm not going to put it in that box, but you put 61 and you 72, it's going to read that number as this. It's going to read it as 617 and not 61. So are those the same numbers? 61 and 617? No. no, right? So then if you were to bubble it in that way, you would be getting it wrong, even though you have technically, I guess, the right answer. But if you bubble it in wrong, it's going to count it wrong. So make sure you bubble it in the correct way, like with your decimals. You can bring them down, just bring it right down like that, and then 72. And then you can go down and bubble it in. Okay, finish them all. Let's let some of these other ones see if you got them right. I'm gonna put mine off. Do, do you want? Do you want us to do one, two, and three? Yes. Go ahead and try one, two, and three. I'm gonna leave mine to where y'all can't see it, so I can work on it, and then y'all can check your answers. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead and finish them. <laughs> oh, another thing is if you write your answer up here and you don't bubble it in, you're gonna get it wrong too because you didn't bubble it in it's going to go off the bubble. So make sure you bubble them in. That's another thing that happens with these. Adrian, you said you finished, right? Mm-hmm. I'm still working. Give them a minute or so. I'm done. Okay. I'm done. Perfect. Let's see if you got it right. Ooh. Does yours look like this? Yep. Does it? Yep. Mm hmm. Good job, Audrina. You're tired already? We just started our day. How dare you be tired? Now you're going to make me yawn. Okay, place value. Hold your breath for place value. There's a lot. Oh, in front of there, if you flip a few pages, and eventually I'm going to give you something to do by yourself, and you're like, I don't know how to spell 40, or I don't know how to spell 1,000. There's a whole page you see with all of these number, writing numbers and words. Y'all see that? Y'all should have it, because this is y'all's binder, too. It's the same thing as y'all's. So if you need it, 
when I let you do some by yourself, there is a page with all of these numbers and words and how to spell them, so I don't want to hear. Um, Ms. Hernandez, how do you spell eight? How do you spell nine? There's a page with it. Make sure you keep it safe in that binder because we're going to be using it a lot this week. Whew. Okay. Excuse me. So on page 16, skill 16, he has to complete the entire thing? Uh, which page? Page six, skill 16. Skills. You just have the page, the one that has the... The grid? Oh, no, no. We weren't on that page. That's way... No, 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 no. Oh, the gridables? Yeah. Yes, we were working on um, just filling these in real fast. We didn't get to them last week. Did he... I don't know if he got to them. Was he able to get to them? No. He did all the fraction stuff last week. Okay. Oh, the f skills. Is that is... Let me see. I think I know what you're talking about. This page? Oh, skill 16? No, 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 not skill 16. We're not even, not yet. We're not there yet. You were just talking about the one with the grid. Oh, he, he went to the wrong one. That's what it was. Oh, it's, oh, okay, because it's gridables. It's on, it's on concepts, and then right behind there is gridables. It was on the wrong one. Oh, okay. It's, un it's under concept. That one's skills. That one's like for later on in the six weeks. That's not right now. Not skill 16. So if you flip to concepts, and then right behind there, there should be a couple of gridables that look something like this. Let me zoom in so you can see. I didn't even realize it. The first one should be 60, 25. I don't know if it's in there. What else do you so yeah, uh, guys, I didn't realize there was another one in skills. So make sure you're on concepts. Otherwise, you could you probably filled in the wrong one. I know, I didn't realize it was. It should be right there behind concepts, either the first or second page. Should say week two. Did you find it, Azu? Yeah, I'm trying to do it. Okay. We're gonna give him a couple minutes off to try to figure this to finish it. Okay. For you. Okay. Hmm, I don't know if I want to log on to the Okay, before we go into place value, we're going to take some notes. So make sure you have your journal that you've been writing in, or if you have a separate math journal by you. Okay? Take some notes. Oh, geez, beans and cheese. Everything's working so slow today. Do we have to do it inside, like, a journal, or we do it inside, like, can we do it inside a sticky note? Um, you're probably going to need to do it inside your journal because it's going to be a little, it's going to be like kind of big, okay? Okay. Well, if you have a piece of paper that you can, like, um, like the file paper or you want to rip one out of your journal and then put it in your math binder, you can do that. Okay. Like put it in your math, like in the front or something, you're fine to do that. But, um, is it the reading one? Yes, I think a lot of y'all have been using the same journal. Yes. Okay, so then it's the reading. If you have a different one. journal available and you want to make that gesture math journal, I would suggest doing that. But if you don't, then just use the gesture. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Oh, 
Are you taking notes of? We're gonna be. We're gonna write a place value, like little anch mini anchor chart. We're gonna make it like a house. Oh my God. <laughs> Can we put our math binder up? Yep. Or so. Uh oh. We have not even got a place value. We're just going to take notes on that. You can move it to the side if you want to. Can. You want to move it to the side a little bit so it's out of your way while you take notes? That's fine. But we're going to go back to it in a second. So just leave it open to where it's at. Mm -hmm. Do. I got a little paper. Okay. I ripped it out of my math journal and then it was just like a tear stitch, so I just tear it. That can be just a journal that I'm going to use for my math, just for when I take notes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Never mind, it just got water all over it. Oh, goodness. You should have water, water, well, water, I can't even speak. Water with a cap on it. You got close, right? <clears throat> Do this again. Stop sharing the screen and I'm going to find the anchor chart I want us to write in here. I don't know. It's so crazy. Zoom is working for me, but everybody else cannot get into Zoom. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> That's funny. Oh, we're talking to each other. Then. <gasps> boom, boom, boom. Crazy. Zoom is not working for so many people. It's working for... My Wi-Fi here doesn't even work. I'm just connected to my mom's internet. Ew, that's not good. <laughs> we find a pretty one. Place value. Hold uh on. -huh. Place value. I got another paper. I'm going to make it into a, a house. I think y'all probably seen the ones with the house, right? <laughs> so we're going to buy a house. We're going to live in there. Uh, yeah, you're going to kind of live in this house, I guess, for this week. If you want to look at it, yeah. <laughs> we are going to live in a house, a place value house for this week. <laughs> oh, here it is. Here's the one I want to draw. Uh, okay. <laughs> are you still working? Thumbs up if you're finished. You might still be working. I'm going to go to so, every time we do place value, you are going to need to draw a place value chart. I don't want to hear, oh, I don't need one because I know where that number's at. And then you're going to end up not drawing one and you're going to put the number in the wrong place. So, let me start drawing what I'm talking about. Place value. Yes. Value. Let me draw. We're gonna make it into a house. Stop sharing. Share this. We're gonna make it into a house. So like um, RJ said, we're gonna live in a house. Yes, we're kind of gonna live in a house all week long. It's a place value house. It's a place value house. So at the top, label it place value. Last year, I think y'all only learned to read. I think it was, I don't even know what, what it was. Let me draw Oh. Okay. How do I have a draw? Let me get my. Here, I need to draw. Oh well. Oh well. So later on in the year, we're gonna learn about um place. Do we write that down or do we do that yeah. or no? Start drawing your place value house. Okay. The best you can. I know it might look a little messy. I'm gonna turn my 
I should have had y'all draw it this way because they'd already. If you want to draw it sideways because there's already lines going that way, you're more than welcome to do it that way. Call this the ones. Last year in first grade, I used to do that. Ones, ten. Sundays. Yes. I used to do this in first grade. I know. In first grade? Or third grade? Yeah. First. I'm going to try to use different colors. Mm, maybe not, because then y'all are going to want to use different colors. No. Well, the next place, we get order in the thousands. I didn't even do it. I was working. I was working on this. I have to make it small, otherwise it's not gonna. It's not gonna fit. I was working on this the whole time. On what? This. Hey, the stay with us. Stay with us. One. I was working on this. Okay, stay with us, though, Jacob. I can keep doing this. We'll eventually get there. So we're on. Yeah, I can just um wait for you, or you can draw this because hopefully I know how to do place value. Oh, well. Better get them right then. But you should be drawing a place value chart every single time. I know how to do place place value, Mr. Hernandez. Okay, but but we still know our math finder. <laughs> Yeah, we're still using our math binder, but we're drawing this in our journal as notes. 100,000. Okay, Jacob, when I see you get one wrong, the first time you get one wrong, you're going to be... Oh, did I skip one? No, I didn't. Sorry. No, I didn't. I lied. I already skipped one. Thousands. Thousands. Million, a million, and then hundred million. Brush pick up. So, like RJ said, we're gonna live in a house. Yes, we're gonna live in a house all week long. Hey. Sorry, there's like your brush house pick up going to get bigger. Me. A million. You got ten million. A hundred million. This is the millions, right? Yeah. Oops. Well, we don't need to go that far, but I didn't go that far. Each day our house is going to grow in size. So today we're going to be living a millionaire's lifestyle. And tomorrow we'll be li living in, I think, a 10 million lifestyle. And the next day, 100 million. And then by Thursday, either Wednesday or Thursday, we'll be living a, like a billionaire. We'll stop right there because that's where we stop. So, okay, yeah. Wouldn't it be nice to be have a billion dollars? That'd be awesome. Yes. Thumbs up when you got that completed. And um, remember, notes you take today, if we have our test on Friday and you need something, a place value, because you forgot what comes after 100,000, you can use your notes that you're taking. Or if something, homework comes up, you're like, I forgot, I don't know, Mr. Hernandez is going to get back to me. You have your notes. And then eventually we'll learn about decimals Probably next six weeks, I think. Yeah. <sighs>
Are you having trouble with Zoom? Okay, I'm not done. No, it's um. Hold on. Beans and cheese, my bad. My brother was having trouble with Zoom. Yeah, because of the teacher. So a lot of y'all have siblings. They're probably not Zooming right now. So let your parents know that there's issues with Zoom. It's not just your brother or your sisters. I told them that. For some, for whatever reason, Miss Hernandez's Zoom is working, which I guess is <laughs> crazy because everybody, everybody else in fourth grade, every other teacher in fourth grade I know right now is not Zooming. So. Don't ask me why y'all got lucky. Y'all have a Zoom. I would just. Miss mm. Hernandez. Yes. Can I go to the restroom? Yes. Real quickly. Break. What time is break again? Let me check. Okay. It's supposed to be at 9.15, but I told them earlier, don't be surprised if our break becomes only 15 or 20 minutes from now until the future, just because we have a lot to do. Is it a no. break? Please be 20 minutes or higher. It's probably going to be shorter than what it's been lately, because we are moving now. Is it, um, is it a break or no? No, it's not a break yet. In like a few minutes it is. Oh, uh, okay. Yes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh yeah, ten thousand. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. Please tell you. Um, okay. Everybody's got this copy down. This is gonna be helpful for us moving forward with place value. I'm gonna stop sharing that. Hopefully you got it. If not, I'll have to make one and put it on there. Okay. Why does he always do that when I do that? So, oh. I'm going to walk through Canvas. Y'all don't need to be on Canvas right now, okay? Y'all are just going to follow along. It's okay. Review some vocabulary. <sighs> oh, no. No! Now the internet's not working. Oh, my sweet Larry James. Yeah, internet's always weak at my oh, house, too. Goodness. Sometimes oh. my phone gets a little bit glitchy. Oh my god. Wi Fi connections get all bad all of a sudden. That's weird. Yeah. So many Even people. when I'm doing the middle of my work and on the weekends when oh. I was just playing Minecraft and started got just loading. Yeah. Normally it loads super fast and it's it's been so earlier. Yeah. Really it's slow. the Wi Fi. It gets glitchy. Oh Lord. <laughs> Mary James. Look at look how slow it is. So bear with us because it might yeah. be slow. We might not be able to get a lot of this going if it's not working. If it's working slow. Mostly because at the, at the school oh. everyone is using the internet at once. Yeah. 
Oh, look how slow it is. We might have to skip this part. The vocabulary. Now so remember, we're in math and we would go to modules, the same thing, y'all aren't doing this, but just a reminder, you can go to modules and find everything. Look how love slow it's flowing. This is crazy. Mine was even way slower than that. That's why it took me a while to come here. Look at this, it's... So remember, for some reason, um, with the internet not working and the zooms. Oh my! Do you want us to go to Canvas? No, 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 no. We're gonna be working on our books because right now, like it's look, it's loading slow for me, so I don't know how it's gonna work for y'all. We might not even watch this video. Actually, I was gonna watch a video and go through some vocabulary, but I think we're just gonna work out of the book now because Canvas isn't working. So later on, hopefully after. Okay, somebody said their power. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> so many problems. We're just going to work out of the book for right now, and hopefully after the break, the internet will work, and then I can go back and show y'all. Okay? So, let me show y'all. Of course, you're staring at me. Break. Working on. Sorry. Right. You're staring at me like a deer in headlights. Like, what are, look, see, like, now the internet's not working. Goodness gracious. Goodness gracious. Okay, so week two, right here. Everybody flip to week two and see all of these. I was gonna go over these vocabularies, but vocabulary words, but the internet's not working. So remember, if we get cut out for some reason, don't panic. Wait, can you play a Oh my god. I can't hear somebody's like breaking up whoever is just talking. Bida, was that you? Yeah, because I need to go back to the place value because I haven't finished registering one more. Which one? Is the week two? I'm on the billions. Oh, 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 the picture? Sorry. Yeah. Yes, RJ, week two. We're going to go and start finish from last week. So right here. I just put those extra ones in because we're not really going to learn 10 billion and 100 billion, but if for some reason, I'll figure it out. Somebody just messaged me that their power went out, so... I wonder why I was texting it to you. You mean the, the packet in week two? Yeah, do you finish, Vila? Yes, RJ, I'm just letting her copy this real fast. Okay, so we're on week two, and we're going to flip. I think we were... I think we're on the back of that page, right? We had, we had done one, two, we had done A, B. Oh, we're on D. So par, make sure, once again, I'm gonna turn this sideways. I already finished this one. Okay, let's see if you got them right, since you're not you. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, so we're on D. We're on D, make sure it says up here, place back to where we at. We need to check. Place value one, page two. This one. This one? Place value one A, page two. One A, page two. All numbers. Place value one, one A. We had started last week, remember? And I think I stopped on Thursday. Where is we do? It's behind it's concepts. Your yellow and then it says week two. Hold on guys, so I can go back. Concepts. Your yellow part, and then it should a few pages behind that. It should say week two. So concepts. Make sure yours says week two. Or sorry, place value one a. No, don't do that right now. 
Oh. Oh, papers are so thin. I keep ripping them. Yes, be careful with the papers. Make sure every your paper says that because yes, last week somebody was doing the wrong one. So we go to count concepts. Concepts, yes. Come on, y'all, speed it up. Concepts, um, page one, place value one a page two. If it does not say this, you're going to be on the wrong page. We started it last week for the most part, and we're going to go back over it again. I'm going to keep my place. I would keep your place value that we just drew in our um, notebook near you because it could be helpful eventually. Okay. Are you ready? Everybody has it. Is it place by value? I take my paper right here. What does it say? No, not this one. can't find it. It's the very beginning, Adrian. Come on. It should be a few pages behind that yellow thing. Or if you go to week two, it should be the first page behind week two, if I'm not mistaking. Or the second page behind there. You have your words, and then the next page should be place value 1A page two. It says place value value I B page one. Okay, flip to the back side. Should be page two, correct? It says I B, not I A. You gotta go one more page before that, because B comes after A. Should be the page before that. I be. I ripped my pay. I ripped page two. Be careful. I ripped page, out page two on accident. Okay, be careful. It should be before B, Adrian. We haven't even got to B yet. There's no I A for There's one I. One A. One A should be in there. Hey. Is it supposed to be um one A um page one? Page two. Flip it to the we're on the back side, AJ. It's the right page, you just flip it to the back side. It should say page two up top, right? Yeah, I found that. Just keep there's only like B's and the only A's I found were threes. Three A's. It's gotta be there. It's gotta be one A. It should be the first page. Go to your go to your concept. Your words right here. It should be the first page. Worst day ever. It should be the first page behind that. First my page gets torn out. Second my I got my did you find it? Adrian, did you find it? This is the page after. I can't um, see that after the move it down. What's it say up top? So you don't have it. Says, place value one B page one. Then just follow along with us because we really need to wait for a few minutes trying to find it. So, just follow along with us on page, 
on this page. And then you'll we'll start on the next page after or in a little bit. So first we have to go plug in our number that's over here into this place value chart to the right. So remember when we're writing our number in, we're start we're writing it from the five going to the left. So we put the five in here, nine, one, three, seven, seven, two. And Jacob's gonna tell me, make sure you put your commas. Okay, hold on, cause I'm gonna turn the phone to see, to make it obvious. Oh. There we go. And I'm going to put my little brackets here to separate the numbers and so I can know what numbers I need to write. Remember, those numbers in between those brackets are um, a group of numbers. Andrina, we go to break when I say it's break. Remember, I told y'all we are probably not going to have 30-minute breaks anymore. Um, word form, what's that first number right there? What place is that two in? Come on, answer. Y'all want a break or we'll work through our break. Come on. What place is this two in? Million. Millions. Two million, so we have to write two million. I know y'all want to break. And then, how do we say this number right here? Right here. Between my fingers, how do we say this number? And it, uh, and 773. Mm -hmm. And then what place is that three in? Um, thousands. So 700. Somebody had a question? 700. Yeah. Go ahead. Are you uh, like showing your paper or just yourself? Because like, if you are, I can't see your paper. I only see you. Let me show, hold on. Let me show again. Guys, if y'all can't see my paper, let me know. I don't know what y'all can see. Hopefully this works now. Maybe that's not right. Can y'all see the paper now? Mm -hmm. Yes. One, mm -hmm. 700, 70, 70. Oh, now I'm like 70. I'm going to try to spell 70 right. So I've got these numbers. 70. 70. Seven. Oh wait, my bad. Not seven. Seven hundred seventy-three. Why oh, you don't write in pen? Thousand. Oh, seven hundred seventy-three thousand. Yes, that's correct. Whew. Make sure you're following along and you know how to do this because there is a Nearpod that has a bunch of these on there that we're going to try to do some. <laughs> okay, another problem we're having. Remember I was just trying to log into Canvas? Yes. Apparently, Canvas is having problems too this morning, so we might not even be able to log into Canvas today, but, or at least okay. this morning. So, we'll continue working right here out of our book. We have plenty to do out of this book. I'm getting on my new pod. Uh-uh, RJ, out of the, right here out of the book. We're in the book. We're not in our Nearpod. Later on, if you can get, and I don't even, Canvas isn't even working right now, so I don't know if it's working for y'all either. We're working out of our book right now. And we'll continue working out of this book as long as I can't get on Canvas. So, how do I say this last number? If y'all want your break, come on. 
This last part. 195. So 195. I'm going to give Natalie her break. 100. Ma'am, you said place value 1B or 1A? 1A, page 2. Should look like that up top, and we're working on D right here, and there's the number for D. I don't see his, that's why. I just see two Bs, okay. no A. That's, that's fine. We're almost to that page anyways. Or Do you have 1B? Uh, yes. Okay, that's fine. We're going to go, we'll, if he can just follow along. We'll ah, and then ah. after, he can catch up with us on 1B. Okay. Um, hey, RJ. Because no. Adrian doesn't have it either. I don't, pages are missing. I don't know. Okay. So. Mr. Mendes. Yes. I don't have the page either. I do not have the page? Maybe they ripped it out and we didn't even know. I don't know. Maybe they did. Maybe we'll just have to go to 1B then. I don't, we'll, we'll figure it out. Okay. I'm going to give y'all a break until 9.45. Okay? Okay. Bye. See y'all in a little bit. Hopefully things work. Hopefully. Hopefully. We'll see. I'm kind of scared to leave and leave the Zoom. Bye. Bye.